people to Amy Lewis is here. Amy, so what's behind all this? Well, financial fair play was introduced a few seasons ago by UEFA, the European football governing body, to try and make the football tournament fair, to ensure that clubs were spending similar amounts of money. But what they found is that Manchester City have overstated their sponsorship revenue and now they get this ban and they get this huge unprecedented fine. Now, Manchester City have released a statement and clearly they feel that they're being made an example of. This is what they've said. They say Manchester City is disappointed but not surprised by today's announcement by the UEFA Judiciary Chamber. The club has always anticipated the ultimate need to seek out an independent body and process to impartially consider the comprehensive body of irrefutable evidence in support of its position. Now, what this means is that they can compete in the Champions League this season, but not the next two seasons. So this season, it obviously it really looks like Liverpool have got the league. So the focus for them this season will be on the Champions League. But if they don't win, then this trophy that Pep Guardiola and Manchester City so desperately want, it's a trophy that they've never managed to win the Champions League. That means uh, that, of course, they won't be able to compete in it the next two seasons. We've never seen anything like this. This would be absolutely huge. But it's important to stress that Manchester City say that they will appeal, but huge news tonight if they uh, are banned for these two seasons. Yeah.